Okay, why the hat, you ask? Well, because my head is bald and it would be so shiny it would blind you. So there. One of the things I really like about cooking is it's a sense of sharing, a sense of community. I love to cook for other people. I love to share food. I love to share ideas about cooking. I love to um, share recipes. I love to talk to people about cooking. I love to hear what other people think about cooking, how bad my cooking is or how great it is. I love to hear about how great your cooking is. And I've always been open to getting suggestions from people on cooking, especially the cooking that I'm going to be doing on this channel. And I've had a request to do more in the way of vegetarian and vegan, vegan cooking. So that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be including not just my meat dish, but more vegetarian and vegan cooking in the future. And today is going to be about that. Today, I'm going to make a black bean burger. So it's an entirely vegetarian burger. I hope you enjoy it.
All right, that's it. There was the black bean burger. It was an interesting experiment. I've never done something like that before. It's a little bit out of my knowledge base. Um, did it taste like a burger to me? Yeah, sort of. Was it delicious? Yes, it was definitely delicious. Um, in my research, because I did a lot of research because I've never made something like this before, I kind of discovered that a black bean burger is made out of some really basic things that you can embellish with other things for, to make it taste like you want it to taste. Um, you know, the basic things are essentially black beans, of course, something to bind it. I used oats because I can use the oats for breakfast. You can use wheat flour, you can use corn flour, you know, anything that adds a little bit of starch to it. Um, you can you, I mean, you should use um, cumin, you should use paprika, you should use yeast, salt and pepper, of course. But beyond that, you can add anything you want to add flavor. Some of the recipes that I researched, they were making them very Mexican style, so it had, you know, peppers in it and, you know, traditional Mexican style. I've seen other recipes that were Asian style. Some people used um, vegan cheese, whatever that is. I have no idea. It's probably made out of bean curds, you know, made out of tofu or something. I don't know. Anyway, um, one thing I would do if I were to do this again is either bake it a little longer or bake it a little hotter. Um, it could have been a little bit better done. And the other thing I would probably do if I were to do it again is add my torch to it to crisp up the outside the way I do my steaks to give it that grilled kind of texture and flavor. But besides that, it was a nice experiment. I thank those people who asked me to make more vegetarian stuff. I'll continue making more vegetarian stuff. It was fun and exciting. And anybody else got any suggestions for me to make? I'll gladly make them. So that's it. Enjoy. Thank you.